64 of Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Tonight, we're doing hacks. Yes, we're going to look at ROM hacks. So last week, we looked at Homebrew, which uh, is sort of a fresh development of a game by a fan. And now we're going to look at what happens when fans mess with existing games. So we've got eight games. I've not played any of them, as always. Um, so I'm curious to see what we're going to get tonight. They, they sound interesting from the titles, but uh, who knows? Who knows what we're going to get? Mm -mm -mm. Um, so I've tried to pick things that we might know. You know that we've we've got an idea of what they should look like, so we know how they've changed. Um, we've got things from the Game Boy. We've got most of them from the NES. We've got a couple of Sega Mega Drive ones, and we've got one NES one that don't even know what it is. S some of them tell you what they are in brackets afterwards. No idea what that one is. Um, very possible we might end up ending with it. So I hope it's not crap. Uh, anyway, shall we get on and have a look? Uh, so the first one is... Uh, well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what we need to do first. We need to get over there, don't we? That's what we need to do first. So, let's do that. Phew. And let's switch to our Game Boy screen because we're going to uh, we're going to Game Boy first. There we go. And uh, we're going to start. We're going to start off quite easy. We're going to play. Um, a hack of the game known as Dr. Mario. You may remember it on the Game Boy, Dr. Mario. Um, but this is Dr. Garfield. So, I've got, um, I kind of assume it's going to be Dr. Mario gameplay with Garfield. But we'll find out, won't we? Yes, we will. Um, okay, so. Not an auspicious start. So, there you go. That's That's what it is. Let's see if it makes any other noise than that, though. Because if it doesn't... That will be very disappointing. So you've got the choice of, of <laughs> you've got the choice of music. Chat room saying you can hear it, but it's very quiet. And all I have to say to you is lucky, lucky chat room. Here, let me turn it up a little bit for you. Okay, so remind me how we play this. I think we have to get the coloured things onto the... There we go, yes, we have to. Match the colours to the virus. All right. Don't mind this a bit Tetrisy. That was shit, wasn't it? Um, look, I'm not going to say pad to you. I'm just not. But it is. It is the pad. Okay, so Houston, we have a bit of a problem. Oh, tip. Oh. 
not very forgiving. I'll give it that. So I think I need to be... How am I going to sort out that white one? Like that. That's what I'm going to do. So as you can see, the hack is... Let's put Garfield where Dr Mario is. It's very possible that we'll get to a point I won't be able to tell you what the hack is. But I'm hoping I've picked games that I at least know what they are. Probably shouldn't have done that with hindsight. Realised that all those other ones, are, those blue ones, are there. I don't know why I didn't realise it. Does it not pay a lot of attention? Maybe, maybe. So if I can get, a, oh, there's a double blue coming up in a minute. Does get them both? Oh yeah. Oh, lots of viruses. Shit. Can you get multiple vi viri? left it. Cluster, don't think it's dangerous. Okay, what do I need to get now? Wonder if I can. Yes, I can. So just that white one then. another chance. Thank you, game. 
it's like, oh, you're an idiot, are you? Here, have another one, just in case. Go on. Why not? Oh. I've done it now. Really have any more white guys to get? I just realised what's going to happen if I keep doing this. They're all going to disappear, aren't they? Panicking, panicking. Yeah, you can see it, can't you? I'm making mistakes. Oh. 
talk to it now. I'm fucked. Oh well. I mean, we have played enough of this, haven't we really? Look at that disapproving look on Garfield's face. I don't know. Well, there he is. Oh, there he was. Garfield. Fighting diseases because that's what he's known for. Good old Garfield. Uh, right, okay, we're staying with the GameCube. Uh, GameCube? It's not a GameCube, it's a Game Boy. Uh, and we're going to play something called... Wario Land 2 Polished and Uncensored. So, but one assumes that there's going to be some Mario Landiness in it. But let's find out, shall we? I bet Nind Nintendo doesn't present. That's quite irritating, though, isn't it? It's like I've got dust on my needle. You can't hear it. You can't hear it. It's a... Well, that's annoying if you can't. So that means it is my computer. The other one didn't make it, though. So... What on earth have we got here now? Come on. I'm tempted to just press start and see what happens. I think this is game, is it game by advanced. It looks quite widescreen. Oh, there you go. Turn off the alarm clock. I must admit, I've not played a massive amount of Mario games, so if this is a part of a Mario game, I'm, um, I, I'm assuming as it's called Wario 2, that it's, uh, a Wario, that it's Mario Land 2? Where am I going? Thank you. 
so you can bash through some but not others. Okay. Oh, and this is where we came in. Oh, I see. Okay. Well, someone's going to get me there, innit? No, can't get out of there. Why is the steps it? Ah, that's why. Can I get out that way, do you reckon? Any further though. Okay, so did we go through that door? Or did we just go down? I think we went down, didn't we? Is there anything we need to get there? Doesn't appear so. Ah, nearly forgot about this side. Oh, stuck. Right, so one assumes you have to go through the next time instead. Oh, can't shoulder charge them ones then. this I drown if I fall in that water. Oh no, I just get pushed back to there. Okay. Go. Oh. oh. Oh, and you can't get out either. Ooh, there yeah, you can. If you're careful. Oh, 
keep banging my head on the bloody... Those last coins were a trap, weren't they? Just to get me to go right back to the start. It was my greed. Tits. Okay. Not sure there's anything anything for us in here. Well, there's a way out over there though. platform here for some reason isn't there yes money is gonna appeal to my greed again and make me jump into the water isn't it oh no tag nab it Magic up. Can't make it. I keep trying that and I can't make it. How am I supposed to get to that door then, do you reckon? No, no, stay, 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 no! That's how you get to it. Easy. No. Oh, it's not letting me pick it. Shit bag. What am I doing? <sighs> no, don't want to go up here, do I? I want to go this way. Ah, 
I'm supposed to get over that. Well, I think we're getting to a, a point where we might want to leave it. No way to go, though. Did I need that guy then to hit this this thing here? This airbag that's stopping me from getting through. I don't know, and we may never find out uh, because that was Wario Land 2. Um, okay, we're moving back to the big telly now as we um, play our first first uh, one of two that's um, based on or around Donkey Kong. Uh, don't really know what to expect with this one. This one's called Bloody Kong. And as you can see by the screen, it's a hack of Donkey Kong 3. Which we have played before. Um, yeah, okay, it looks like it's exactly the same game. But Donkey Kong's got a bloody face. And on the upside, he's not making a farty noise. So, uh, do like this game. So we're going to play it anyway, even though that's the only change on it. Try to be smart. So, I don't actually know if you're Mario in this, but you, um, you've got to give um, give Donkey Kong a, an enema. And avoid the um, insects. Now, I do have a little problem with my pad in that it um, it jumps when I want to move from side to side because up is jump. Got to have another go, aren't we? So yes, nothing close to this. Um, this could be one that they're, well, it, the game plays exactly the same. So this is just a sprite change. Um, and it feels like Donkey Kong doesn't move up his ropes as quick as the actual game. And it does seem like I've just lost a whole bunch of flowers in that, I didn't. At least we got past uh, the first, yeah, first stage. Oh, my God. 
Mm. See, I just jumped into into a whole cloud of them then. Do you know, one day, one day, I'm going to plug in my arcade stick and I'm going to play with the arcade stick. Maybe when we do an arcade episode, perhaps. I don't know. Not sure I've got the drivers for the Mac, though. We'll have to see. I've got it working on my uh, Mr. FPGA, so we could do that, I suppose. Just have to find a way of um, hijacking it so you can see it. Have I still got my uh, shoot the aerosol? I haven't, have I? I got that before it got to its house. Jumpy Jumpy McJumperson. <sighs> anyway, that was bloody calm. Um, I like the game. Didn't need to have Donkey Kong with a bloody face. But I am blaming the tools. Yes, yes, I am. And I'm sure I've said this before, but this pad can go in like eight different directions. It doesn't just go up and down and left and right. It goes diagonally each way as well. And all these games that I have real problems with have a, a distinct up, down, left and right. That's, that's how they work. So if my thumb's not right on the cross, the little cross here it tends to go in a diagonal and when it can't work out what diagonal means sometimes it picks up and I don't want it to go up I want it to go left especially in this game where up is jump so I know I'm not making excuses I'm explaining what the issue is rebel scum uh, right okay let's move on now, a couple of weeks ago, we did um, our Dig Dug episode. So, I thought it might be worth having a look at a hack of a Japanese game that um, somebody's entitled Dig Dug 3. So, I don't really know what to expect here. Um, and I'm not even going to attempt to tell you what the Japanese game is. But uh, we know Japan, uh, not, not Japanese. We know Dig Dug Two was a, a bit different from Dig Dug One. So let's see, let's see what Dig Dug Three is, shall we? The oh, they can't seem to get the music right, can they? Okay. All right, all right. So so far so dig doggy. Oh, it's a gun, is it? Oh no, I can't do anything with that. That must be a rock then. I don't know. I don't know any of these. What am I doing? Okay, so <laughs> no dig diggy dug in as such. It's more of a shooty shooting. Oh, 
Cat, kill a ghost. Okay. What's the green thing, do we reckon? Oh, speed up, man. So, how do I, how do I, oh. Oh, I can get through them, then. Oh. It's a portal. All right. Portal, man. In it. So, does that mean I can, whoa, whoa, whoa. Came out of nowhere. Governor. So why can't I pick the key up? They do appear out of nowhere. Can I pick it up this time? No, I cannot. shots I lost out okay that's worth another go look if you're in random maze shooting stuff it's all right by me oh button oh oh their bullets reach further than mine Do you have to uncover the other end then to make to be able to go through them? Case of getting the satchels and getting out. See, whenever you see me going upwards, all of a sudden I veer left or right. That's exactly what I'm talking about. I right, can't go any further that way. further down either. Alright, how many keys do I need to get? Thank <laughs> you. 
Time. We've got more X's. Oh, hello. Oh, shit. Ah. How do we get down there now? Something a tiny bit satisfying about smoking the ghosts from Pac Man. Okay, so we've got underneath. Oh, you can't get under there though to get that satchel. Hmm. Wonder if you go through that. No, you don't. This game makes me a little claustrophobic. Oh no! Oh, I'm sorry, Nutty Cluster. Is that because you picture yourself underground? Oh, now I can't get out of here either. That can't be right, can it? Why have I changed colour? Dig Dug 3, very similar, very Dig Duggy. Anyway, um, but cool, I quite like that. Ah, right, okay, so we're gonna play our second uh, game that features or is based around the game Donkey Kong. Um, I must, I must say, I'm quite interested in this one. I'm excited to play it, and I'm prepared to be disappointed. I am. This is uh, Jason versus Freddy, the Donkey Kong edition. So, you know, in my head, I think I know what it is, but so we've run it. Right. By George. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay. Must admit, not super disappointed. It's what I expected. Is that going to kill me or is that something I can pick up? Something I'll pick up. Oh, you have to jump off there. Okay. Oh! Should stop trying to be clever, shouldn't I? Oh, come on, we've got to play this again. Too high. It's Jason for God's sake. Oh no, that was too high. I do feel that um, Jason and Freddy's heights are a little disproportionate. He looks like a, a dumpy little fella, doesn't he? Jason, and he's not. He's a big bugger. Sort this out, shall we? Oh, F in school. I need my lives. Ah, <laughs> uh, I don't dislike that. It plays very much like Donkey Kong. Very, very the samey. Um, I don't know enough that if you've got Donkey Kong patterns, whether they'd work in this. But it's um, it's obviously a reworking of the NES. Um, Donkey Kong. So. 
I wonder if it's going to show us any other uh, any other levels. No, it's not. Go on, show us next. Show us next. No. Ah. Uh. Okay. Well, out of the ones we've played, I think this one and Dig Dug Three are my favourite so far. Not that I normally rate the games we're playing. It's just like, oh no, I quite like that one. It's what I expected and you didn't disappoint. Thank you. Um, right. So I don't really know what to expect with this next one because this one's called Transformers More Than Meets The Eye. But it's actually a ROM hack of Pac-Man. So one assumes we're going to see a game of Pac-Man, um, but I can't tell you what on earth we're going to get from a play and what it's going to look like. So let's have a look. Beware the Decepticons. Oh, all right. There we go. Okay. Couldn't go upwards then. Can't go down. Can't go down. I might be due a new pad. Let's spend some money on controllers, shall we? now the distinct effort to get me there sake would be nice just to clear one board ah. honestly honestly this <laughs> is Fucking paddle with the death of me. Well, it has been a number of times. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, thank God. Wow. Transformers, more than meets the eye. And you can kind of see, I know they do look a little bit like fairies, but you can kind of see they're uh, a touch pac man -y. I'm, not, I'm just like, oh, do I, do I want another go with this pad? It really is doing my head in. It's fine on, on older games. Uh, not on old games, on newer games. It's, it's fine. It's just... <sighs> no. No, we won't play it again. We'll move on. Uh, but we are moving into our last three games. So, it's again, it's going to be... Uh, unless one of these games takes us in a way that makes us play it a lot, then... Um, Could be in for another short show. Okay, so this one is called Luigi in Sonic One. And again, I have my ideas of what I think it probably is. But um let's find out, shall we? Sega. Ah, Pretty much exactly what I thought. Okay. Oh no! Cheeky swine bag. Feels like he's got a different jump to Sonic. Like it, it feels higher. Whether it is or not, I don't know. Cat head button then. Thank you. 
Come on, you dickhead. Oh, I did it again. Got up that last time. Ah, oh. <laughs> you cock. What do you mean it's tough watching me play through it? I don't know. I just don't get no respect. What would you like me to do? Walk through it slowly and explore everywhere? I know I should have jumped through the big thing before you tell me. Numb nuts. No, I'm sitting quite comfortably actually. Oh, you see, if I was Sonic, I would have killed that. Concentrated then and everything. And I was distracted by my other machine turning off. Which it shouldn't be doing. Oh, stop it! I guess it's because Luigi doesn't have the spikes that Sonic has. Yeah, I got it that time. Hmm, twice today that machine's rebooted. Wow, I wonder what's wrong with it. No, 
out the spikes killed me last time. One sec, I've got a big screen right in front of my face. Just need to minimise it. There we go. Ah, oh, well, that's where you're wrong, Nutty Cluster, because I'm not playing Sonic, am I? I'm pl playing Luigi. Irritating. For Pete's heaven's sake, shit bags. <sighs> See, if I was if I was Sonic, my spikes would have got that and turned it into a bird or some shit. So I'm not quite sure how different the mechanics are. <laughs> it wouldn't matter if Elmo was here. He can't play it on screen any more than you can. Oh. Need a drink. However, how cool. Um, Luigi in Sonic the Hedgehog. We have many other characters in Sonic the Hedgehog, so at much to Nutty Cluster's delight, you're going to be able to watch us play a lot of Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, watch me play a lot of Sonic the Hedgehog in upcoming hack shows. In fact, just for Nutty Cluster, we might just do one that's just Sonic the Hedgehog acts, so that she can watch it for an hour and a half. Anyway, there you go. Um, so let's have a look at our... Well, so this is a game. This is Streets of Rage 3. But it's called Streets of Rage 3 and in brackets it's got Sonic Hack. Now, I don't know if that just means it's something about audio or what. Um, but it could be something to do with Sonic the Hedgehog. Could it not? So let's have a look and see what um, Streets of Rage the Sonic hack entails. It does indeed have Sonic. It would be rude not to play with Sonic, for want of a better expression. No audio. Feels a bit weird. I think even Streets of Rage would have some audio over here. Let's see. <laughs> Don't dislike it, I must admit. It's a bit, little weird.
How dare you head book, head but uh, head jog. There you go. Take that scroll. I think that's me getting hold of them. Oh, what a weird, what a weird look. That's jump. Okay. Grabs him, grabs him by the head and or the hair or something and then just hangs off the hair while he beats the crap out of him. Sonic with a knife? Jeez. Is that, is that Donald Trump in a gun? With a gun? Don't leave it. Sonic. Oh no, is that it? Oh no. Let's get out of there, shall we? remember not liking the bikes last time. Teaming. Well, that was a good one. Don't know what I did there.
so. I want to see if I can at least pick up a gun or something. That would be freaky. These are quite difficult, are these guys? Girls, guys? Things? Stand up in the line so I can, uh, oh, chicken. Oh no, I'm having a chicken beating out of me. Yeah, when you roll into them, all your spikes do them like continual damage. Oh no, that's it. No guns for Sonic. Wow. Well. Can't <laughs> I can't say I disliked it. To be honest. Um wow. Okay. We have a whole bunch of Streets of Rage um hacks as well for our future um future shows. Uh, but we're going to move to our final game of the evening. And it's going to be um, a, a late entry, you might say. I put it on sort of just before we started, really, um, as I was looking for something in the SNES region. Um, and I just didn't know. I don't know what, what this is going to be. This is called Nightmare Busters. So, is it about Ghostbusters? Is it about Nightmare on Elm Street? Is it about something else completely different? I'm betting something else completely different, but... Um, Nichi Butt 2. I've got a Nichi Butt 2. I'll just give it a scratch. Okay, so let's see what we've got, shall we? I mean, it does kind of break the rule as I don't know the game that it's based on. Uh, yeah, I might once we start, but I don't at the moment. Oh, hello, hello. Okay. So neither of the things that I suspected at the start. All right, we've got a, a bloke. Can't kill him quick enough. Oh. Thank you. 
Okay, I don't know what the hack is. I don't even know if this is a real game. Um, kind of like it. It's rock hard though. Can't seem to get anything that can kill these things faster than they can get to me. Look, wow. Dead already. my lucky coin. Oh! I said, I mean, come on. That just came out of nowhere, that. all my superpowers, like my stronger powers when I die then. jump that one. Oh, for fuck's sake. fly earlier on. Oh! Oh, I see. Look, look like we got past. Is it boss level? the other side of him then. Oh, he got right up close in my face. Oh, 
thought was invincible when I did that. Fast enough. Todge. Oh. Now, you see, I'm curious because that doesn't feel like there's any hacking going on there, and I wonder if uh, if it's maybe a translation hack. Perhaps. Do we need another go? Now we've got kind of an idea of what's going on. There's not, you'd think there'd be some lettering or something there, wouldn't you? Oh, young rap scallion. chest. Now we're now out of play, I'm doing worse. Bestos pants, don't I? Oh, this bit again.
Can be burnt. I didn't move. Oh. We're just getting my rhythm in as well. charms oh and that seems an ideal place to um, stop And say that's our last game played for tonight. Um, yeah, there you go. So, it's only one thing left to do. And that is... Crack open the wheel. And give it a spin and see what we're playing next week. Um, ooh. Ooh, next week. Maybe the week after. Um, Jurassic Park is 30 years old in June. Um, so one of these shows, we won't be spinning the wheel and we're going to be playing Jurassic Park games, I think. Um, we'll see how we get on. But, um, oh, I've not removed hacks from the wheel for now. There we go. That's easy enough to do. Um, so we'll spin it tonight. And then make a decision later on about Jurassic Park, I think. Uh, so, let's give it a go. Okay. Right, we're going to be playing some PlayStation. Tomorrow? Uh, tomorrow? Next week. Um... PlayStation games that we haven't already played 
on the show. And that's a wide, wide range of games. So, um, yeah, pretty good. Pretty much got free reign to play whatever I want, as long as it's on the PlayStation and we haven't already played it. Wow. Okay, super. Uh, let's go back to this one. The uh, the hello and goodbye screen. Um, thank you. Thank you for joining me live. If you have done on a Monday night on Twitch, thank you if you've watched on YouTube. Um, please comment and subscribe and all those things if you're uh, if you're on on YouTube and um, you want to see a game or something like that, just to show show that you're out there. Yes. Um, so thank you for watching. Um, if you want, you can email us. It's super easy. You see, oh, push my finger too far in then. Look, retro at snugradio.co.uk. Retro at snugradio.co.uk. That's also the website, snugradio.co.uk. Um, that's the, the place to visit for all Snug Radio stuff, uh, including the podcast that's just um, just celebrated its 19th birthday. Um where else are we? Well, we're everywhere. That's the short version. We're we're um, we're on YouTube, like I say. We're on Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Twitch, like I say, as um, Snug Radio. Believe it or not, I know, quel surprise, eh? But if you really want to chat, you can come and join us on our Discord. The link will be in the show notes or the post of the video, or you know, it'll be next to wherever you're watching this. There'll, there'll be a link to it somewhere. And uh, come and join us, see what we're getting up to on the Discord. Um, we've got retro game section, we've got the retro music section. We've recently um, talked about crisps a lot. It, it, it's that sort of thing. Yeah. So um, you're more than welcome to join us at, on Discord. Um, and I think, I think that's everything. Um, so have a super week we'll be back next week with playstation games yep um i've been math this has been snug radio's retro lounge play something retro goodbye